Hey everyone, and welcome back to um, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Today we are going to continue where we left off and f try to free, um, what's his name, um, Naboris. And I f kind of figured out how to get to one of the heads. But it's basic. We basically have to go on the other side to activate it. But I just want to go back on the head for a moment, just so I can um basically just activate that part. Because I'm assuming that this thing right here is basically to, um, open up that door. And hopefully this one will open up. But was it something glowed? Okay, so there's one part. So it was spinning, that's why I couldn't go inside. And now we have activated the door to get to the head. I don't want to use a valid scale. This music is so relaxing so far. <laughs> That's... Oh... My, that's a dust trap in there. Looks like what a dust chamber would look like. I gotta take a risk. Ouch, the lasers. Yep, it's on the head. Now get rid of that thing before... A night shield. And what does that mean? I activated the door. But what does this mean? Is it the is it what the lasers are doing to it? Hmm. 
That won't work either. I'll just have to come back in here. So, anyways, I managed to find out how to get to one of them. Somehow, I managed to get find out how to get. Anyways, I think I found out how to get to this one. Oh, there it was. That next one. Stop, stop, don't stop, stop. <laughs> Examine. There are two, two more terminals remaining. One in the center of it. Of its head, and one in the, um... That's that's where I want to go. Now what is this? I don't know what. Royal Ball. Somehow we need to find our way into the center. Can this chest tell me something? Obviously not, so, um... We'll just have to throw you off, then. Hopefully, Rosa didn't have anything important in that chest. That, that's where I was before. Where is the other one? This head. Part of it. The last time I remember... The last time I used it, I basically just used, um... Ravali Scale. I 
get up there. I'm just gonna play a little game. Which is basically shooting through that. Just because I'm bored and I'm I want to wait for Ravali's Gale. We only have one minute and and fifty um fifty seconds. <laughs> Ravali's Gale is now ready. Okay, Ravali's Gale is now ready. Now, let's just get up there. Now, what is this for? What's in here? Wait, I've already gotten to that one.
Obviously, I can't go out there. And I don't know what that is. So... Is this just there for me to turn it? It's probably just there for me to play with. And I also found out a way. I wish, actually, wish there was a way so we could, um, basically. I'm trying to find out a way so I can see the um, HP bar of the enemies I'm fighting. So, basically, it can be basically a set of numbers. And now that we've gotten out of there. Where should do I place this? Now that works. I'm assuming there is a, um, that switch is there, <laughs> so I can basically, um, get up there and get into that door. Let's see it open. Okay, obviously it won't open. Then what is that thing? F then what is it for? Oh, so I can get to basically that one. How am I gonna open up this one? Some reason I'm already starting fight with the guardians. I don't know how I'm able to open this one. Let me look up. Look it up. Okay. 
Okay. Rivali's Gale is now For some reason, I just grabbed my own other remote. And Rav guess what? Rivali's Gale is already ready again. But that's not the reason I'm back. Somehow, I found out I, how I can get to this one. And what did, will that lead me to? What is it going to get me to, basically? Is it going to get me to the tail a whole lot easier? Or I mean the, um, shrine that... The, um, terminal that's inside the other room? That one, basically. <laughs> okay, my sledgehammer broke. <laughs> Got some ancient stuff. And we got some a Hawaiian shroom and an apple for some reason. Oh, I meant to go into there, I believe. Okay, but oh, this room. I'm okay, so I managed I managed to get That's probably why that little electrical thing is there. And there's another way to the head. And what's up here? Okay. Basically, if it's right here, it won't. Then, how am I gonna get to this one? Is that why that electrical ball is there? That was probably just a way to a chest. This was... I think this is where it was meant. 
Okay, managed to get here. Just one more left. And that's inside the head. And now what's happened to the music? Mm. It's gotten serious now. And very serious with this music. Now we just need to find out for this one. This just went... This music is... Oh my... a combination of desert and Japanese music. I just need to find... There it is. Oh! Great, now how am I gonna get to the head? Somehow I gotta get inside. There isn't anything here. The head is- I saved the head for last. So I can just find it out. <laughs> Wait, maybe I should just go to this save since I managed to find find out how to get to it. And it'll just send me back to the beginning with the door open.
and there it is again. That was my... Uh, my plan was to just grab that and... Never mind. I need to get to that. He I need to get to the head. But how did I get to it last time? Obviously not by doing that. Maybe I went for there. I don't know how I got to, um, the, um, I don't know how I managed to get to the head. I don't know how I managed to get there. Hold on. Okay. Some reason for somehow I actually managed to um when I found my way on the head, there was an actual easier way. So I didn't really need it. Um anything to him, um, just trigger it. But what I need is Ravali's Gale to get up there. I rely on Ravali's Gale way too much. I'm relying on it way too much this for some reason. That's okay. And that's the that's the reason why the door wouldn't basically open. Rivali's Gale is okay. I know Rivali.
know. I w oh, I wish I could go back. That's pretty much what I need to do. I need to basically switch it to the point where the um, entrance to him is switching. So I can basically get to the head. And then I can activate that terminal. Hopefully this next boss will be just easy. Well done. That was the last of the terminals. Like the yes. last three. You'll take a good look at your map, but overconfidence can be a deadly foe. Overconfidence can be a deadly foe. Okay, I'll keep that in, no, in mind. And now this music is, um, basically doing that. Hold on, before I t hit this, I want to take a nice listen to this music. Mm, it's move. It's it's basically terminals, four terminals, but I'm a lot faster. Now, let's see our boss. What's this? A shield? On your edge, Link. This formidable adversary was made by Ganon and brought me to a warrior's demise 100 years ago. Do not allow this to be your end. Fight for your life and its death. Okay. Watch yourself. How fast is it? Let's go on the battlefield. Oh! You scared me! Oh! That thing moves like a ninja! I gotta dodge it! Rah! At least I have guardian resist armor. <laughs> Come on. I'm not sure if it's even fighting me. Come at me. Okay. I need to take a picture of it. Oh, 
Don't crouch, Link! Come on! I dropped my royal shield. It is my pleasure. Let's go. You're completely vulnerable without a shield. So just a tip advice to anyone who who can't do this boss. I switched my item just in time. <laughs> Wait, where's my... What he's what is he doing now? Oh no. Is there something I need? Pillars? What are these for? Do I have to strike them at him? Where did he go? Now where did he go? Caught me off guard. Caught me off guard for a moment. Yeah. 
I don't care what I'm doing, I'm risking my life. Where's my shield? Are you serious? Not lasers! Come out, come out wherever you are. Come on out and show your face already. Okay, retreat, retreat. How do you expect for me to get up there? <laughs> Come out and actually fight! Yet another boss done on the first try! From what I've heard, this boss was actually pretty impossible. And I- and it is! But I- that- but I did it on the first try. I guess this guardian- this ancient armor is really powerful. Now we got 14 hearts. Royal shield. Just need to get my shield back. So now we can basically open this up. Once you activate it, you blah blah blah. Yes! Now, what do we have? I knew you wouldn't let us down, Link. Thanks to your valor and skill, my soul is free. And Noboros is ours once again. Which means that finally, we can complete what we started years ago. We Gerudo have no tolerance for unfinished business. Herbosa. I've waited so long for the moment to see you finally rush Hyrule Castle. As well as for the moment when I incinerate Ganon into a pile of ash. Which reminds me, I wanted to give you a little something. Please accept this gift, which has come to be known as Herbosa's Fury. It will no doubt be of use to you. Uh, Herbosa's fury. Huh. Huh. Oh. Both you and the princess, I know you have suffered much regarding what happened to us champions. But this is how things had to happen. 
No one is very blame. So please, make Sorry, it clear so she understands that. Tell her to shed any worries. And let her know. I couldn't be more proud of her. You take good care of the princess. Oh, and also, take good care of her. Now what? Heading. Legend of the Gerudo, celebrated over ages. And you, who were named to honor her. You are a legend as well. Isn't that right, Naboris? Who's Naboris? The bitter essence of defeat from a century ago still sits upon my tongue. But that is now in the past. It was written that Calamity Ganon once adopted the form of a Gerudo. And that will make this victory all the more satisfying. I like that. Now I can take this personally. Once we've established a lock on that thing, it will be up to Link to keep Ganon occupied until the moment we unleash our strike. That moment is going to be so delicious. <laughs> Bolsa's fury, a destructive power born from the unbridled anger of the champion of Urbosa, summoned a powerful lightning to sur the surrounding area. Trigger with an attack by holding Y. Link. 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 Thanks to you, all of the divine beasts have returned to us. And the spirits of the champions are free. We will all be awaiting your clash with Ganon at Hyrule Castle. Sure thing. Now we have to go back to Kakariko Village to complete the task. But, um, now let's see what. <laughs> Wow, that is amazing.
I can k any enemy like a stone talus or a um Hanox I can kill. Even the Lionels might be afraid of me. Okay, but anyways, let's get to the um. Let's get back to where we were. And. Well, well, well. There's Naboris. Too bad I can't revisit the Divine Beast. Now I'm raging. Is there something? Oh. Mm hmm. Phew. Just two of these things? <laughs> Thank you. And what do you have to say? Now let's see what's in here. Sick tomorrow of the, of the 7th. And a daybreaker. Sick tomorrow of the 7th and a daybreaker. I wonder if anyone could remake these. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video and it's the first one you've seen, please like and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching.